Welcome wrestling fans back to another edition of Captain Voorhees' Cabinet of Curiosities. As always, I'm your host Jason, and today we're diving right back into my GM mode on WWE 2K23. Uh, so this is our first week, um, this is the week right after the pay-per-view. Uh, our last pay-per-view uh, pay was Backlash, so this is uh, week six, leading up to hell. In a cell. So yeah, um, as you saw in the last video, I went ahead and checked my emails and all that stuff. So I got to give Nikki Bella a main event match this week, which is uh, no big deal. And then let's see, for Triple H's commissioner goal, do not book your most popular fighter this week to get a coast to coast. Oh yeah, see, I don't, I don't do the GM inter interference thing. And actually, I don't think I can anyway because uh, what was that my most popular fighter, Jake the Snake? Nah, we're about to get him. I uh, can't remember. I had a plan for him. I think I was gonna have him feud with KO. But yeah. Make sure you uh, hit that subscribe button, like, share, all that good stuff. I would really appreciate it. You can help uh, get my numbers up. That that'd be awesome. But anywho, let's uh, let's go ahead and get our logistics out of the way. Yeah, I I had a good show uh, on my pay per view, but I ended up losing a lot, of, uh, a little bit of money because uh, you know Bischoff threw the power card on me to double my match cost. Uh, so let's see. We're gonna go ahead and buy this Vito Superstar. Uh, I can hold off on them. So I got contract negotiations, Vito champs, arena cost. Less than 60 popularity. So who would I want to do that on? Less than 60, so I could do that on Andre, GG. Nick Mann get his uh, popularity up, but I got to rest him. I got to rest a lot of people. Like Warrior, even he even looks at the ring and his stamina already automatically drops like 15 points. It's insane. <laughs> okay. Logistics. Fleet Center. Basic, basic. So we're already at 45,000 cost. One on one. All right, so Nikki Bella. I need to get her. Who do I need to put her? Who was I going to put her against? She just got through doing Maurice, so I can't do that. I'm going to have to sign somebody. Nikki is a bruiser, so I need a fighter or a specialist. Cruiser. Shit balls. That was no bueno. And I don't think I have not I don't think I have the legends, no. Nope. Fudge sickle. Crapola. She's a face. I just got through doing her. Although Christina Damn, her, her uh, freaking stamina, though. Her stamina sucks. I could get her in a single... A single feud, possibly. With Nikki. Because she's already... She's in a tag feud, so that's alright. Hmm... 
I'm gonna have to do it. And I'm going to let's see, power card. Do I have a physio? I don't think I, I think I already used my last physio card. Yep, let's go to the moon. Uh Christina. No, 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 no. All right, I want... Jesus, AJ has fucking 20. Uh... I want to have Jake go up against Kevin. No... No title match right now. We'll, we'll, we'll hope for the rivalry to start. Um, we need somebody for AJ. He just got off a program with Andre. Oh, wait a minute. Or was I going to do... No, because Kevin, Kevin just got through with Razor. He's gonna he's gonna have to stay off the show. Molly. Could try to get her in a Molly's a bruiser though. Damn it. Actually, well, I'm gonna try. Let's try doing Molly and Maurice. No, oh, I can't do tag. Herp. Normal right now. Um, I guess Cora and Vicky. Damn, Cora's popularity is 93. That's awesome. Let's actually let's do let's do a table match. And then she has a two. Oh, actually, let me let me look at my season stuff again. Okay, so I need to book an advertising promo. Well, finish your gold comp. Do a role change. Self promo and an advertising. So self promo. Who do I got that actually has some stamina? Now let's have Andre do a self promo. Advertising. Let's have. God, my guys are hurting so bad. Vader needs. He needs to recover. He'll recover six stamina from doing a promo. And I. I he has the promo skill of four plus the, the popularity, so that won't hurt if. Call out. We're going to do. Alright, Jody has a two. Carrie has a one. So, Jody is going to call out Carrie. Now let's tweak the match order. Alright, so that has to be the main event. Their popularity is good. All right, we're gonna have KO and Jake the Snake start us off. But this to mid card one, have them have the ladies close out the show. 
Let's check power cards again. Can be a superstar. Get, can get free arena booking, but I'm gonna save that for one of the later shows. Had two weeks to contract. We're gonna add that to Molly's. I don't need a fixed match. I don't need that. Oh, I got that one too. Add another four weeks. I'm gonna hold off on that one. Yeah, we're gonna hold off on all that. All right. So let me wrap this down. This is week six. So, opening match. KO versus Jake. And we're hoping for a robbery. Mid card. Match one. Cora versus Vicky. We're hoping to increase that rivalry. Mid two Molly versus Maurice. Hopefully that will start something. And I'm not sure about this one. I mean if it starts something cool, basically you just making Nikki happy. Nikki versus Fury. Christina Fury. And then call out Garcia to rush again. Okay, well, that is going to be our show. And I think we're going to watch that KO uh, Jake the Snake match. It's spectated. When has this loading up? I'm gonna show off my uh, my Night of the Creeps shirt from uh, from uh, FrightRags.com. As you know from watching my other videos, I absolutely love Fright Rags. They have awesome horror and cult apparel, and you know other. Other items like stickers and socks and uh, souvenir glasses and pins and all that good stuff. So yeah, wearing this because uh, I just heard uh, we got our first announcement for the uh, the horror convention that my wife and I are going to in September, the Silver Scream Con. Finally announced um, the first three uh, guests. So. It's going to be Skeet Ulrich, Tony Todd, and Tom fucking Atkins. So hell yeah, stoked to uh, to definitely meet him. So yeah, that's going to be that's going to be awesome. So yeah, definitely, definitely go to uh, check out FrightRags.com. Highly, highly recommend them. Again, and also, you know, go back and uh, watch either for the first time or watch for the multiple times. Uh, you know, my my what what's in the box videos. Again, to suit to you know see firsthand some of their. Uh, Awesome shit that they have. He certainly is a captivating performer who's going to try to run the show in this match. And we'll see if he's ready for the psychological warfare of Jake the Snake. So I mentioned this before. It's interesting that they have Jake the Snake 
in this when he is still, I think, uh, he's contracted to AEW. But there's no Sting. There's no Hardys, which... Well, no, the Hardys haven't been gone. Well, yeah, I guess they have been gone for several years. Um, but, yeah, no Hardys, no Chris Jericho, stuff like that. So it's weird how they're kind of, like, picking and choosing some of them. I don't know. I've yet to download any created wrestlers. Because, uh, one, I just haven't thought about it. And, two... I think there's still issues with the game to where certain game modes like it can uh, crash the game and stuff or have it lag big time. So I'm like, yeah, I don't really want to <laughs> deal with that kind of crap right now. And I think uh, actually the first uh, DLC pack should be coming out, I think, any time. So hopefully I have enough uh, virtual currency from some of these other modes and stuff lined up so I can get, you know, the couple people that I'm actually interested in. Again, as I've mentioned in some of my other uh, videos, overall the season pass isn't worth it to me. The wrestlers as a whole, there's only like one out of each, each uh, planned pack that I'm kind of remotely interested in, so definitely not worth the uh, extra money for the season pass. Springboard DDT. He's doing a DDT on the DDT Master. Package pile driver. Oh, no, never mind. Package power bomb. <clears throat> stomping a mole. Um, oh shit, was it? Stomp, uh, stomping a. Oh, frog splash. Stomping a mud hole in him. Come on, just start the rivalry. That's that's what I want, baby. Stunner. Oh, he's too close to the ropes, though. Taking it to Jake. Owen showing some dominance here. This has become all Owens. Jake sidesteps that. Planning on what to do next. Oh, snake eyes. Dog. Oh, what you doing up there, Jake? Double axe handle. I will rule you. Ah, ready to rumble. I need to track that movie down. Oh, KO's busted open. Yeah, Ready to Rumble is, you know, again, cheesy goodness. And he'll leave the ring for this next stretch. Good match so far, as you would expect from uh, these two. Again, Prime, Jake the Snake. the steel steps. So again, how's uh, how's your GM mode going if you're playing it? Let me know in the comments. Love to hear about that. And again, how you're liking the game in general. I still am really liking it. Uh, as you saw by my, my last video posted, I've been doing some of the My Rise legacy, legacy side. And 
again, other than... Oh, there's the DDT! One, two, oh, kicks out. He has the red, red head, bloody face and all that, kicks out of the DDT. Um, but yeah, again, there's some total cringe storylines and dialogue and stuff. I mean, there, there's only a little bit in, in my video, but playing, playing some stuff after it, it's just like, what the fuck? Like, all the women seems like uh, they're portrayed, you know, they're, they're like fucking high schoolers. Some of the dumb shit that, you know, starts things up. Like, I just had a feud with Becky Lynch over stolen oatmeal. And that turned into a whole ordeal. Oatmeal started a feud. Fucking stupid. <laughs> but, again, you you unlock, uh, there's a bunch more customizable stuff that you unlock playing through my rise, and I guess my universe also. I haven't done my universe yet. So, I mean, there's an upside to all the cringe and everything. And again, I, I started with my legacy because, uh, ooh, counter the bulldog. Oh, big boot. I started with uh, my legacy because another stunner. Too close to the rope, so. Three gets him. Oh, come on, rivalry. And give me a four star. But, um, hold on, let, let's see. Come on, come on. Only good? Come on. That was easy, a three and a half. But, we started rivalry, so that is awesome. Yeah, my legacy, that's the only way to unlock the three Molly Hollies. And, as you can tell by this, you know, the women's legend side is severely lacking. Because you, you got no... The, Ivory's not in there. Sensational Sherry's not in there. Jacqueline's not in there. I mean, Sable's not in there, but, you know, fuck her anyway. Um, who's some other ones? Luna Vachon, she's not in there. She'd be another good one. So, yeah, that's why I... I did that one first. Okay. Andre got it. popularity up. Uh, simulate. Cora picking up the win. Wow. That one got a three and a half. So that's going to fuck up my curve, but that's all right. And the rivalry went up. Shit. Was that rivalry three now? Cora, 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 Cora. I'm missing my... Where's my thing at? I know. I'll, I'll check it out again after the thing. Give me that money, Vader. Hell yeah. So that that's half the cost of my show right now. So excellent. All right. Simulate Molly and Maurice. Three star. Okay, so... No rivalry, though, so that that's a bummer, but... Weak promo, but that gets the rivalry to four. I can rest them up and blow it off at the pay-per-view. And let's go ahead and spectate the main event. She's not going to do her her spin, I guess, because she has the belt. Here's your punching bag for the evening from Taipei City, Christina 
Christina Fury. Again, this start something cool. If not, it's whatever. Again, we're just doing this to make Nikki happy. Oh. Yeah, she is hungry and she is tired of waiting her turn. This is her opportunity to prove herself, and she is not backing down. This should be an interesting matchup. But let's stop wasting time. But that's all right. Her popularity is going to go up anyway, so that that'll help later on down the line. Thanks to that power card to the moon. That means you can look, but you can't touch. Stopping down. Nikki Bella traps the Oh, counter. Uh, an elbow, oh, an dragon, snap dragon. There they go. It's another uh, another complaint and or pet peeve about the game too. It seems like at least in uh, my rise, it seems like certain things they set you up to where you you have to go like well above and beyond to win the match that's ridiculous so again in my my cringe becky lynch few that i was just telling you about uh one of them one of the matches in there was a literal dream match because becky you know she keeps getting pissed off that you won't give her a rematch so you know she was not taking no for an answer and she's like well you know you'll eventually give me give me my match I'm, I'm in your dreams so yeah you, you, you can continue the story and in your dreams you're fighting three Becky Lynch's and I hit each of those biatches with like two or three uh, finishers each they're all head and body and some of them have, with arms some in the legs in the red and everything I mean, it was like a 45-minute match to win that thing. It, it was ridiculous because it said attempt to win. So anytime it says attempt to win the match up there, which you can't see because my my camera picture's up there, you know you you know you're in for some bullshit. Whether it's uh, you know a run-in distraction or something something like that. So that's very annoying. Oh. Fairly competitive match so far. Just don't get hurt, Christina. Kick out at one. Okay, okay. Oh. Indeed, is it it? No, kick out at two. Now, Nikki, she had a different finisher, didn't she? I'm trying to remember. So I think the Bella Buster, what they said. I think uh, Bree used that. And then, like, eventually, Nikki... She, she did a different finisher. Was it the Implant Buster? I can't remember what it was. But yeah, Nikki actually, you know, started improving in the ring, unlike Bree who's married to one of the best wrestlers in the world in Bri uh, Brian Danielson. Or Daniel Bryan, in, you know, as you knew him in WWE. Oh, damn, big knee to the face. Shit, are we going to have an upset? Oh, go to hell. Oh. 
close to that upset. Throw her back in the ring. Knee drop. Distress showing in the face of Nikki Bella. I can't dispute Fury's strategy right now. <clears throat> and see, it's still messed up that they don't let the women bleed. The, the old WWE games, the women could bleed just like the men. Oh. So at least uh, AEW's Fight Forever, they'll have that. And hopefully we'll hear some more news about that here soon. But I'll definitely be getting that when it comes out also. Nikki has a finisher ready. But you gotta get her in the ring. Man, this is about as close as you can cut it. They're playing with fire here. Oh. First off the post. You're gonna go for the count out? Get in there, Christina. There you go. Display of power by Nikki Yeah. Yeah, that that's her her actual finisher. Wow. Not a bad match. Not bad at all. Two and a half, really? That's bull. And no rivalry, so that sucks. I disagree with that. That should have been at least a three. Jake and Kevin should have been minimum three and a half. All right, WCW. So yeah, they got a lot of people hurt, it looks like. Where the big boys play. Mediocre match with them, okay. Ooh. JC Jane with the upset against Beth Phoenix. Run in with Shinsuke. Yeah, poor finale, I know. Alright, so yeah. Robbery won. All right, so theirs went to two. No injury, so that's good. No robbery, no robbery, no injury. So yeah, Christina's definitely gonna have to sit out. Amazing booking, blah, blah, blah. Actually, no, let's see. Wow, he actually went the show without getting uh, injured. Or having an, an injury, I should say. That's right. Make me that money. Let's see. Maurice forcing a DQ. Don't understand the fuss about Molly overrated. Okay, whatever. Happy with my performance. Decent up promo. Cora looking real good. Yeah. What? Too much of the same stuff this week. Let's see superstars with different classes. They all had different classes, dipshit. KO's a pathetic cheater. Really, yeah. Good promo by Vader. Of course, because he's Big Van Vader. The Mastodon. Nikki with her streak still. Alright. 13, 48, and then budget.
All right, so my budget's still bigger. Still has a few more fans, but I got another to the moon, so that's good. Seasonal challenge, inspiring loyalty. Remember, this is a marathon, not a sprint. So this will definitely change. Your fans want to see great matches. I don't see. Oh, shut the hell up. Variety of fights. What's... Oh, well, yeah, yeah, yeah. I, I get you on that. Yeah, but my, my tag teams are all ran run to the ground because of stamina, which, again, is partly my fault, but it's whatever. Shut up. What? Rematch with Stacy? I remember you asking for one. Oh, shut up, Christina. Oh, snap. Robert Rude. Specialist. Heal specialist. Hi, McMahon. Listen. I'm sick of working for Bischoff at WCW. Okay. I'm more than happy to ditch my contract and come work at Raw. I'll do it at a discount. Oh, no, no, sir. No, not not for 132. Oh, I, I can't. If I had more money, dude, if I had more money, I'd be I'd be happy to sign you, Glorious. Oh, oh, yeah. If that was, say, half of that, like maybe 50 to 60k, yeah, snatch you up in a heartbeat. But yeah, I, I can't do that for 132 right now. Not right now. So yeah, when... Shit, I don't remember that. Oh well, whatever. Have at least one Hell in a Cell match this week. That will give me... Ooh, that will give me free... Oh shit. Might have to try that. Okay. Okay, let's see. Actually, let's go ahead, let's go ahead and get this set up. So we're at week seven. Alright, let's go over to our power cards, fix a map. Oh. Physio, hell yes. Vito, random superstar, hell yes. I already got one fixed match. So we might hold off on that. See how my roster's looking. Alright, stamina's going there. Well, shit, do I do Hell in a Cell with them? God. <laughs> Oh, my stamina's so fucking bad. Okay, can sit them out. Cora can sit out. Vicky can do a call out. I need to get their tag, tag rivalry up to four. I got Razor right there. I think I might have... I'm going to have Razor call out Warrior. And I need to get... I could do... God, AJ's fucking hurt too, though. But I could do AJ and... and Fish against Vader and... Nick Man. All right. Oh, that's not what I want. Yeah. So that's still gonna be my only two legends. Free agents. Who we got? Argus, the Great, Matt Adore, Lula Tandy, permanent thirty k. Not bad. Penelope, perfect. 
What's she got? She's got a one for promo. Lula Tandy has a one. She's a bruiser. I don't know what, what do I need. Okay, well, let's just let's just go ahead and book, and then we'll see how how the promos and stuff look after that. Okay, so you know what? So one hell in a cell. God. Okay, so that's only thirty-five k. Title on the line. You want a tag match? I'll give you a fucking tag match. Okay. And... <laughs> Fuck, they're so hurt. They are so hurt, but... If this gets up to four... I mean, I can still blow it off at three, level three at the pay-per-view, but if it gets to four, that'd be better. Get them to four, and then I can rest them the rest uh, the other two weeks. Uh, they're gonna call out. They just got through doing shit. Let's do another tag. Vader and Nick versus AJ and Fish. What? No. Okay, so I need to have Maurice go up against somebody. Maurice is a fighter. <sighs> so fighter. So I need a bruiser. All right, so Lula Tandy, she is a bruiser. Sign her. Andre is a giant. I have no cruiser down here. Okay, I go back to book. Maurice versus Lula Tandy. Oh, I got my power card also. Let's go ahead and do. Yeah, we'll do a table match. I'll book it. Uh, power card. Mother to the moon. Oh no, I, I it said I used it. Okay, shit. That's okay. Pre-match. Okay, we're gonna set this up at the at the pay, at Hell and Cell. We're gonna hit the good talent. We're gonna veto veto bunch of his people and double the cost. Yeah, we're gonna fuck him up at the pay per view. Okay. So that needs to go there. Uh, 
That will be a banger. That should be something because it's a level 3 robbery. Oh shit, AJ has fucking 32 also. Gah! <sighs> Razor call out. Warrior. I need advertising promo. So we're gonna have Nikki do advertising. Do I need to do another call out? Yeah. Cora needs to rest. So Vicky will call out Cora. That's gonna be shit, but it's whatever. Hopefully she'll stumble upon it and get a couple more popularity anyway. Uh. Oh yeah, so now I got, so Andre. Again, I wish 2K. 2k next update have multi-man matches for the title for the love of god please put that in the next damn patch it's ridiculous i can't spend that kind of money on these people Good sign silence. For Argus. Argus actually has a 2 out of 5 promo. 13 weeks. I'm going to go ahead and sign Argus. So I can potentially... Depending on what happens. Or even... If something does happen with the tag stuff. I can put Argus in a match with... AJ fix the match so Argus wins the title. Yeah. That's what I that's what I'm thinking right now. Okay. All right, I'm fine with this. I kind of have to be. <laughs> All right, opener. Stacy Molly versus Gigi Fury. Three. No title on the line. Um, that's already rival. Um, mid card one. Maurice versus. Lula table match mid number two we got Vader man versus AJ fish and main event Jake Versus KO Hell in a Cell. I'm sorry. Hell in a Cell. Got it. You got to say it right. Title Rivalry. All right. We got Call Out One. We got what's that? Vicky. Vicky. To Cor Cora, and I uh, need that to go up to level three. And then call out number two, Razor to Warrior. All right, let's confirm it up, baby. All right, title's not on the line. 
assimilate. Yes! Alright, rivalry grows. Christina's gonna be pissed off again. So rivalry four, three star. Okay, promo, good. Uh, sorry. Alright, that's alright. Rivalry three now. This is gonna be shit. One and a half. Two, hey. Well, and that started a rivalry. Awesome. Two star. Rival one. I will take that. Give me that money, Nikki. Fuck yes. Thank you. All right. Veda Man versus AJ Fish. Simulate. Don't get hurt, AJ. Please don't get hurt. And a rival. Uh, mediocre, boo. All right. So. Two star. Rival one, and I can still go. I can still do my plan. I can still do my plan. Excellent rivalry number one or level one, and it's time to spectate this hell in a cell. Again, it kills me that his lips aren't fucking moving when he talks. And gentlemen, this is what it's all about. Let's get it on! A DDT. Froggy? Nope, nope. Yeah, what's uh, what, what's Kevin waiting for? Oh, getting a baseball bat. We got it. We got Cringer Jones. Hey, buddy. Hey, buddy. Going for an early pin. Oh, yeah, face planted on that one. I haven't played a Hell in a Cell match yet. I've finally played a TLC match and a regular steel cage. And, uh, that was definitely fun. It's actually how, uh, in My Rise, my character Ripley Pride, again, named after, uh, Ellen Ripley from the Alien franchise, and then Kitty or Kate Pride, as she's going by now, uh, of the X-Men, Shadowcat, uh, her and her partner, Ava Moreno. That's how we won. Uh, when we we won the title, we we got the chance to because we won the Money in the Bank TLC match to get the the contract or whatever. But we beat uh, Oscar and Tamina, and then we actually fought fought the Bellas, 
in a steel cage. And yeah, that was fun. We triumphed over that. Or in that match. After I nearly messed up, I got to the top of the cage and accidentally pressed the wrong wrong button. So instead of starting to climb down, I just stood up to, you know, do a move off the top and I had had to basically just whiff because I couldn't get back down or whatever. Oh! Well, shoot, he still doesn't have any durability loss yet. One, two, kick out. He really thought that was it. Punch to the gut, but misses the knee drop. This is getting bad, guys. Roberts needs to think about his career. As we all know, Hell in a Cell matches tend to deteriorate once the competitors leave the confines of the ring. Are they actually going to? Them right where they want go them outside they might not it's been a few instances when they actually haven't left the cage oh luckily Jake has still has some durability might, maybe not after this match oh kicks out at one after getting the ship beat out of him with the bat The Sting Special. Jake's like, nah, son, you're not taking my... Oh! The kick out was on pure instinct. Oh, it's gonna hit him again. Oh! Yeah, Jake is busted open. It's kind of hard to tell with the, the red cage. He's still got life in this matchup. Uh-oh. He's one step ahead there. And that could be a uh oh charging up the DDT. Oh, no. Oh, stole his stunner. The champion had every move scouted except their own. He kicked out at two. An arrogant display from the champion. Stealing that move might just light a fire under the challenger i can see it in the eyes from here disbelief unbelievable how this one is still going on clearly hoping something yeah look at the crowd back there very nice nice job on making them you know feel alive oh look at the elbow look at just hammered away in the back oh Nice. Oh, yeah, I saw the fan too. So, yeah. It's funny uh, that, you know, Daniel Bryan's not in here also. And Moxley, which Moxley doesn't surprise me because, you know, he basically said, you know, F you to WWE anyway. Is that it? Nope. Kick out at one. Damn, Jake. Sleeper hold. Rear naked choke. For you MMA fans out there. Jawbreaker. So stay in the cage. Oh, unprotected he headshot. You better have an aptitude for pain because it just keeps coming. I'm not sure if you can actually 
unfold a chair and like you know do drop toe holds and shit like that off of it or not or if you know like it's down on the ground right there if you hit a move on it if that does extra damage oh are they actually gonna go outside now oh i say almost miss a super kick another jawbreaker well hello there rock and roll <laughs> and Jonesy. Mm. Rock and roll. Hey, buddy. Let's see if he starts playing with his tail again. He. Oh! Took that super kick from him. Yeah. Jones and Rock and Roll just started getting back up in the crow's nest and again after a while. Because you know how how weird cats are. And then yeah, Rock and Roll's been been playing with his tail some more. So he hasn't done that in a while. Oh. Jake has two finishers. Kevin's almost to one. Jake's tougher than a two-dollar steak. Oh, what an uppercut. So impactful. And what's he looking for here? Settling on the kendo stick. Kendo stick. Tommy Dreamer. Sandman style. Will head back to the oh. oh, misses. The snake with the arm ringer. Oh, short arm clothesline and a knee to the face. Is he busted open now, too? I say, don't taunt him, just hit him. German. Release German suplex. Too close to the ropes. And a kick out at one again. Damn. DDT. Boom. Oh. Jake went up to three finishers. Hit him, Jake. Oh, kick out. Got, got two more. Are you going to hit him again? Yep. Number two. So that would be what? Number three for the match total? Jake wins the title. Oh, snap. That's got to be four stars. That's got to be. Raise that title, Jake. You earned that shit. And a half, hell yeah, and the rivalry grows. Hell yeah. All right, so we had three star, two star, two star, and a four and a half. That's that's a nice drama curve there. Hell yeah.
Oh yeah, we're fucking with your show so bad. Oh yeah, this is gonna be great. All right. Beth Phoenix run in. Damn. Bobby Roode was angry, but he's, uh, was that tag title holder? Huh. Again, Bobby, if you didn't won 132K, you'd be on my show. Couldn't drop that kind of cash in my current state. Good booking. Come on, that should have been amazing booking. Fuck you. All right. So, yeah, four star, no injuries, so that's good. Again, three. The one rivalry. Level one, no injury. No, nope. yeah, I'll take that. Yeah, I made the mid game. Okay, because you're using all established stars, but that's going to bite you here. Because you're going to get everybody hurt. Again, that's what Adam Pierce did in my my one that I finished. So I gained 52k fans. Made 66, might as well say 67k in profit, so that's good. Who the hell is this Lula Tandy? Sign as cannon fighter, I guess. Hey, man, you gotta start somewhere. Chair show mania. Show some respect. Love tonight's Raw. Look forward to the next week. Yo, Raw, who deserves a championship on her waist court? Jade. Well, we'll get there. We'll, we'll try face versus face, whatever. Yeah, Christina's angry, blah, blah, blah. The snake wins the championship tonight. So Kevin's going to want a rematch, which is fine because we will definitely give it to him within the next two weeks. Styles and Fish worked okay as a tag team, I guess. Uh, I hate that generic crap. Generic response. Start strong, end strong. Good. Core J was called out. Warrior. Keep it in your mouth while you can, Razor Ramon. It's going to be wired shut for a while after next week because I'm going to get the rocket fuel. I'm going to take it to the moon. <laughs> All right. Actually, that kind of hurt. <laughs> Ooh, their show cost 100K. Shit, he still made money, though. All right, I got my free arena booking, which might use that. Okay. Two weeks till hell in a cell. Think you should put me in a match with John. Trust me on this. Uh, yeah, we can do that. Hey, boss, I've been talking with Tandy a lot and tag team. Yeah, yeah. I think we'd make an awesome tag team. Yeah, I'll take a chance on you within the next few weeks. Alright, ensure that your least popular available bruiser is in a match this week, and that will get me to the moon again. Okay. Oh, what's we got? What's we got here? Power cut. Oh, God. Hell spas. Yes. Yes. Okay, so. Can't do that yet. Cannot be used the week before pay-per-view, pay so I need to do that now. But crew costs, we don't have anything for crew yet. Oh, yeah, we do. Because that's what... 10k, so that'd be 20k if he actually books it. Or he actually uses them. Actually, we're going to use that at the pay per view also. Two times arena cost. 
So yeah, we're definitely going to use that one. We're going to go ahead and use that on Molly. And then next week we'll use the other one on Jake. Alright, let's go ahead and book this one. This will be the last last week we book on this this video week eight <clears throat> all right and actually let's go ahead and check out the agents damn uh, macho sally steamroller ella rubo silence Jerry Sweat, yeah. Okay, again, so... <clears throat> what do I need to do? My least popular bruiser. Who is my least popular bruiser? Least popular bruiser <clears throat> is Lula. And yes, you're going to be in a match. So Lula and Cora, where's Cora at? Cora has 46. So I could put... I could, I could do a tag match with that. That would make her happy. I could even start a rivalry with them. Let's see, let's see, let's see. No. Alright, get logistics out of the way. Boom. Boom. And that's gonna cost me shit, that's gonna cost me 50k at the pay-per-view. <clears throat> Alright, yeah. Alright, let's just go. Uh tag match. Cora. And Lula versus Maurice. Oh, yeah. Maurice. And where's, uh, where's Vicky? There's Vicky. It's gonna be a regular match because stamina. <clears throat> Actually, uh, let's see. Where's, uh, power card? Oh shit, Jake's stamina dropped big time. Where's Kevin? God damn. <sighs> stamina, there we go. Uh what buddy? Uh, so they want to, he wants a match with, oh, actually I can book a tag match with him and that will count. Kevin's happy, like very happy. Oh, but I don't need to do that yet because I need I need to drop the title. I'm gonna drop the title off of AJ. Uh, I want to fix the match at the pay per view to where they win. Hopefully that'll get her not angry. Uh, the 18. Let's put. But Kevin in the big hell spa. I'll have Jake call out Kevin. And we're going to hell spa warrior. Let's 
So yeah, let's go ahead and get that set up. Call out... Jake calling out Kevin. Uh, Razor calling out Warrior again. And I need another advertising. Where's Stacy Keeves? Stacy only has a 56 popularity. I'm going to have to get something with Nikki started here soon. Nikki is a bruiser. <sighs> Nikki is a bruiser face. Donna has a 1.5. They have a 1.5. We'll go ahead and sign Donna. I'm trying to get her something, I guess, with Nikki eventually. Okay. So I need to. That's happening. I need Nick. Nick Man and Fish. And that's going to be probably a stinker. That'll make him happy, tag match. I need AJ versus Argus title match and I need to fix a match where you at where you at Argus is going to win the title I'm going to win the US title I think yeah it's a US title what the hell is going to be my main event That is the question. It's gonna be. Got no options, man. Need somebody to go up against Andre and some bullshit. Definitely not that. So, Andre. Could do Andre Hurricane. Even though I really don't want to drop 48,000 on him. Could do Kombucha. <laughs> but I think I need a little bit of star power for this one. So, it is what it is. We'll sign Hurricane. I'm gonna have him and Andre. They got stamina, so. Balls count anywhere. That's gonna be shit. That's gonna be shit. I'm gonna take a chance on the shock factor, maybe beefing that one up. Uh, actually, no, let's do. Actually, no, let's do. You're gonna go on first. That's gonna be shit. 
That actually might not be too bad. So yeah, we'll, we'll keep that one right there. Oh my goodness, we got some people hurting. I got no physios. Okay, so this is... Was it again? Two weeks till... Hell in a cell. So I need to hit Bishop with this crap right there. Right here. I can use that on the go home. So that's not that big of a deal. Crew cost. I'm gonna hit him with that. Arena cost. And with that. Double cost, that will be at the pay-per-view. Who I can get free special effects. So that's good. So alright, so my pay-per-view, I can do free special effects, free arena booking. Excellent. Alright, well that looks like it's gonna be the card. Get me. They're so gorgeous. They'll set you free. Why isn't Tyler? Oh, do I have to unlock him in like my rise or something? Cause yeah, Tyler's not in the the legends. Come on, Ben. So I, I I draft Tyler. All right, opener. Andre versus Hurricane. Model. Balls count anywhere. Balls count anywhere. Mid card one. Nick Man versus Fish. So that's going to be a one star. Mid card two. Cora Tandy. Versus Maurice McLeod. Vicky. And then main event. AJ versus Argus. So yeah, he's going to have the title. All hail the queen. Queen Zelina. And then we have call out one. Razor to Warrior again. Cuz again, Warrior's got to get his fucking Stamina up. Because his cardio is shit. And call out two. Jake to KO. All right, baby. Let's book him. Welcome, Dano. We're just gonna simulate this stuff. Actually, I probably should, should probably should have watched that. Andre, three and a half stars. Excellent. I'm glad I switched that around. No rivalry though, but we can fix that. Three and a half. Rivalry two. Didn't they already have rivalry? No, no, they just started. Yeah, so that's right. That's right. Rival 2. Nick Man versus John Fish. One and a half, okay. And it started a rivalry, whatever. Rival 1. Give me that money, Nikki. Yes, another 20k. Awesome. Simulate the tag match. Oh, and they won. Okay. That was a two star.
again. That's just making people happy. Level three. And the rivalry remains. Oh, yeah, it won't let me. It won't let us watch because I fixed it. That's all right, though. Just give me like three stars. Wow, that actually got three and a half. Awesome. I, I was hoping because it was a title match and everything that it would do something like that. Three and a half star. No rivalry, though. That's all right. I can start giving him, you know, self promos and shit and building him up. All right, simulate theirs. Again, I wish we could watch some of their matches, even though it's a computer. But it's it's all good. Damn. What the hell is he doing? The TLC tables, extreme rules, extreme rules. Jesus, what the fuck is B Bishop doing? Oh, oh, it's gonna be so awesome when I double, when his cost doubles next week, and then all his champs are gone, and then I, I increase the cost of free agents. <laughs> oh. All right. How's that still good booking? My drama curve is right there. Yeah, amazing booking, blah, blah, blah. Because you have all gimmick matches. But all right, so no rivalry. They started one. No rivalry. No rivalry, but title change. No injuries, and that's also good. Okay, still got some of that. Oh, yes, that's awesome. Total profit plus 101k. All right, Core Jade and Lula Tani work really well together as a tag team. Who the hell is this Argus the Great? Pretty good debut, all things considered. Like tonight's Raw, Nick Mann and Herman are great superstars, but their classes just don't work. Yeah. Love Raw, but whatever happened to Warrior? Because Warrior, he takes one step and he's out of fucking breath. You gotta rest him, dog. Because Warrior, he skips cardio day. He doesn't skip anything else but cardio day. He sneezes and he's out of breath. It's Vader time. Enjoyed seeing AJ Styles lose against Argus the Great, who's a far more talented fighter. Who? 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 So, huh, should I... Is that saying something like Vader wants some AJ? I don't know. Those kind of call-outs and stuff don't make any sense to me, unless it's just general... He'll talk and smack against face. I'm not sure. Hurricane versus Andre was great. Good fit of classes. Hey, Raw, is the Hurricane all right? What What do you mean? Is he looks worn out? Give him time off? It's his debut. That makes no fucking sense. His debut match. Lula Tani sailed his score with Maurice. No way. Raw got the Hurricane. That's awesome. John Cena sucks. John Cena sucks. Wow, he still made a little bit of money. That's insane. He's not going to make money next week at the go home. Not with double shit. All right, I got my two the moons. So that's going to be good. All right, well. There you have it. Uh, this is what going through week nine. So, starting up next video, we'll have the go home show and then the raw paper, uh, the Hell in a Cell pay per view. 
Uh, thanks for joining me on this video, as always. I appreciate it. Make sure you like, click that subscribe, share with your friends. And until next time, wrestling fans, peace.